All right, listen up everyone. If you are looking for a job or you know someone who is tonight is the deadline to sign up for our WCPO job fair, which happens this Friday. Consumer reporter John Matarese is covering the rebound and tells us who's hiring and the best way to do a Zoom interview to boost your chances. Are you ready? The WCPO.com Cincinnati Works virtual job fair is this Friday. So here's who's hiring and what they're looking for in an interview. Would you like to help make beer, build medical testing kits, or create store packages? Those are some of the job openings you can apply for at our Friday job fair. So we're on a big hiring push right now. Teresa Cullen says Boston Beer's Over the Rhine Brewery needs workers to package its new Sam Adams canned beer. Interested in the medical field? Meridian Bioscience in Newtown needs assemblers to make test kits. Sean McMillan says no college degree is required. I can bring someone off the street and train that individual as long as they have a high school diploma. Pro Ampac needs workers in its Tri-County plant. Abby Grubb says you'll make packages used in stores. A lot of things you'll see in grocery store like the packages of applesauce that little kids can eat right out of. Friday morning, these companies will do Zoom interviews. Here's what experts say you should do. So the first thing you want to do is find a comfortable spot in your home with a decent background and where there's some light on your face. You don't need a suit and tie like this or a formal Sunday dress. That comes off as a little bit dorky if you're at home. Skip the funny or distracting t-shirt unless you're in high school. And no plain undershirts, please, no matter how muscular you think you are. So dress business casual, look the interviewer in the eye, appear eager to work, and keep distractions like pets and kids away. That's according to Brian Bowman, CEO of localjobs.com. They have to present themselves, sell themselves as a likable, responsible, reasonable, communicative individual who could do the job. Interested? Go to WCPO.com and look for our virtual job fair story right on our home page. But hurry, the deadline to sign up for the job fair is tonight. Tuesday. Covering the rebound, John Matteries to be CPO 9 News. Not sure I'm comfortable seeing John in short sleeves there. Well, let's continue this job conversation though. If you're looking for work right now, do not underestimate the impact of your social media accounts. They can either help you or they could hurt you very badly. Experts say when you're looking for a job, what you post on social media is part of that interview. They shared these tips. Make sure you have an updated professional picture on your LinkedIn account. Include two or three strong references and make sure your resume matches your profile. Now, when it comes to Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter, watch what you post. Avoid posting about politics and religion.